Welcome to ActivitySuite.com. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to send reports to your clients. The steps we'll be taking are add incident types, create activity logs, send out bulletins, build a PDF report, and email it to your clients. On the menu bar at the top of the screen, hover your cursor over Admin, Company, Incident Types, and click. This is the page where you'll be adding incident types. Click the Add New button at the top of the screen, and in the pop-up box, fill in an incident type. Leave the rest of the default settings as they are for now, and click the Add button. There's your first incident type. Use these steps to add all the incident types that your company normally uses. Activity Suite will allow you to add as many incident types as you need. Then you can move on to step 2, creating an activity log. For activity logs, hover your cursor over Dispatch, Log, and click. Here on the log page, you're going to click on the Add Log button. In the pop-up box, from the drop-down menu, choose which site you want to do the activity log item for. And for type, choose one of the incidents you just created. In this field, you're going to fill in the activity. Activity Suite will allow you to use up to 2,048 characters. You can use Activity Suite's built-in spell check to make sure there are no mistakes. Then click the Submit button. The log item will now show up in any reports you send out. You can now move on to Step 3, Sending Out Bulletins. Bulletins are normally sent out by dispatch from the BOL's option. To send a bulletin to your security officers in the field, hover your cursor over the Add New BOL button and click. In the pop-up box, from the drop-down menu, choose which site you want the bulletin to go out for. For priority, choose one of these levels. Make sure include All in Report is always checked. Select a date range you want the bulletin to cover, and in this field, fill in the information. Once again, you can use Activity Suite's built-in spell check to make sure there are no mistakes. Then click the Submit button. To see how the bulletins will look to your security officers, hover your cursor over Field to BOLs and click. This box will pop up to let them know that they have a bulletin to acknowledge. They cannot go anywhere unless they click the OK button. In order for your security officer to acknowledge the bulletin, they need to click the ACK button. Now that I've shown you how to send a bulletin out to your security officers and have them acknowledge it, we're going to move on to step four, building a report and emailing it to your clients. Activity Suite has streamlined the process of building reports. To start, hover your cursor over Reports, to Assemble, and click. During your trial mode, this box will pop up reminding you that all your reports will be sent out with a watermark and are not recommended for distribution. Click Continue to finish building your reports. You can choose from the last 24 hours or choose a custom date range depending how often you send reports out to your clients. Activity Suite has pre-selected several of the items you're going to be needing for your reports. For now, Leave the default options as they are and click the Build button. Status of Report Build will let you know once all the reports have finished building, you'll be automatically sent to the distribution page. In these fields, you can add additional email addresses. Remember, if you can put more than one email address in the same field, separate them with a semicolon. To view the report before you send it out, click on the site name. Here's a copy of the report your client will receive. On the top of the first page, you can see the bulletin, and if you scroll down to the second page, you can see all the information from the activity log. 
close this window to return to Activity Suite. After you finish reviewing all the reports, click the Send button. Email distribution page will let you know once all the emails with the reports attached have been sent out. Now that you know how to send out reports to your clients, you should be up and ready to go. Remember, you can always see other helpful tutorials at www.activitysuite.com/tutorials. Thank you for watching this video.